you as a coach have a lot of power. And if at any time during practice you blow a whistle or you tell kids to come to you, they stop what they're doing and they run to you. You have to take that responsibility very seriously. And that means there will be times that your players do things that are really good and you get congratulated for it as their coach. But when it's not going well, it all has to be to you also. You have to take responsibility and find a way to fix it. The most important person in my life was, was my late mother who passed away about 15 years ago. She had one rule in our house, and that's that every day that we went to work or went to school or played a game or coached a game, she wanted us to know one thing, that win or lose, our mother was always gonna love us no matter what. And so now what I try and do as a coach and what I want our coaches to do with their players, I want them to know that no matter what, I love them and I believe in them. And if the kids you coach know through the ups and downs of their life that their coach loves them no matter what, you'll have a lifelong impact on the kids you get to work with. And so if you take responsibility for the good and the bad that happens with your players, and you always let them know that you love them no matter what, you'll be the kind of coach that changes lives forever. It matters a lot more that these kids know you love them than if they can shoot the basketball. Everybody up, here we go. Everybody up here, come on. Okay, let's go, let's say team on three, okay? Because we're always a team. One, two, three! Yeah. Thanks, guys. Thank you. Thank you, Alex. Okay? Yeah. Great job, guys. Great job. Okay? Great job. Great job.